Hello everyone, and welcome back to My Little Pony RPG 2, Cutie Mark Crusader Warriors. I turned the music down some, so hopefully you should be able to hear me better. In the last episode, we went through the cave and I left it on a big cliffhanger to see what lies beyond the door. And I leveled up my party a fuckton. Let me, let me show you. I don't think I showed you my status in the last episode, but I have majorly increased my stats a lot here. Now, you'll notice Sweetie Belle's attack is very low. I'd like to remind you that's because she is a witch or a mage or whatever you want to call- wait. Hang on. Are my eyes deceiving me, or was Sweetie Belle a maid before? Did something happen? Eh, whatever. Scootaloo! Uh, not that powerful, but still pretty good. Apple Bloom! A lot of attack. A lot of speed. Yeah, I really buffed up our ponies, so I'm probably over-prepared for this, I'll be honest. So, if I whoop this boss's ass in like three hits, I'm not gonna be surprised. Maybe I will be, we'll see. Now let's find out what lies beyond the door. Hello there. Hmm, more intruders. The King of Topaz needs that jam. Can we please have it? Never! This is my world stone. Oh no. That look. It's the same as the ponies in the town. You're right. I won't say it again. This is my world stone. Maybe we should help him come to his senses. Fight, 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 fight. Evil Paladin. Alright, <laughs> I'm probably gonna whoop his ass. Also, I learned some new spells! Thundera, Blizzera, Reflect, Poison, Faithra, Blind, Fog, Confu- Actually, I learned some of these. Yeah, I leveled up a lot, so that's a thing. Thundera. Attack! I didn't get to see how much health he had. Down to half health! Oh my god! <laughs> He's already down to half to ex almost like pretty much exactly half health. Oh my god! Attack him! <laughs> Attack him! <laughs> oh my god! I'm way over prepared. I'm way over prepared. <laughs> Oh! Oh god, I'm crying. <laughs> I knew it! I'm way- Look, your protect is not gonna save you, okay? You're gonna die, okay? <laughs> You're gonna die! <laughs> oh my god, oh, oh my god. Ah, my eyes are stinging from crying! Ah, my eyes are stinging from laughter! I'm not sure if this is karma, but I sh I was so overprepared, oh my god! Ah, my eyes, they sting! <laughs> oh my god! Ah, fuck! My eyes, they sting! I'm good! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh my- I knew I was overprepared! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! But you know what? It was worth it. Hey, an apple- apple pie! <laughs> and he's just gone.
That was not a tough fight! <laughs> okay, okay. Getting back into serious mode. <laughs> that was not a tough fight! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, the irony of that sentence. Oh my god, that was fucking- that was fucking hilarious. Yeah, I'm so tired. You hardly did anything! I, I mean, I guess you could be tired if you use a lot of magic to cast Thunder, uh, which, by the way, is a very, very handy tool when you're grinding. <sighs> Me too. Well, at least we have the jewel now. I wonder what he meant when he called that warp stone a world stone. That is a good question. I imagine it has something to do with the overworld. Also, something that came to mind. Um, when I was grinding outside, be outside before, I was considering, um, how are we going to get off this island? Do we have like a boat or something? Who knows? Let's just get out of here. I'm really tired. Yeah, maybe the king will explain it. I sure hope the king is not going to betray us. You got the strange jewel. It's not orange, though. I don't think. Ah, but now we must w make our way out of here. Also, the reason Sweetie Belle is in front is because I thought if I put Sweetie Belle in front, she would be able to use her attack first and, like, quickly take out enemies with Thundera. Apparently that isn't how it works, so I don't really know how- I don't really know how it works. Also, I just want to take the time to say, um, Nurse Dashi, I know you're watching this, and I want to say I greatly appreciate these games you make, because these will really help me when I'm recovering from surgery so I'm not left bored, so these will be a, these will be a great time killer, so. Awesome job on making these games, and I really appreciate the work you put into them. So, I just wanted to give that sweet shout out to you, because you're one of the people who's really changed my life ever since I discovered the first MLP RPG. Like, I never realized how much I'd enjoy these had I not tried it out, so... Thank you. These will be great for when, I, for when I'm gaming during recovery, so... Keep feeling awesome and keep being awesome. And don't worry, when I do MLP RPG 5, I'm sure it's gonna be a blast. It just might take a little while to reach it, considering that, uh... You know, RPGs like to take their time with stories, but you know, that's not, al that's not always necessarily a bad thing. Good quality stories matter of quality, not quantity. So, people who take their time with games, they're awesome people. Those who don't, they just still need to learn something. I don't know if I'm gonna be over-prepared for the next area. I imagine I'll still have a little bit of trouble fighting them, but not too much trouble at all, if any, if any trouble at all. So, it's honestly hilarious that I, I just killed them in like six to nine hits, and they all act like they're exhausted. And it's made even funnier considering I spent literal hours grinding for these levels and they don't even seem all that bit tired until they defeat, defeat the Paladin. Although the Paladin might have been their limit to like, a certain boss being fought, like, if they fought one more monster they'd become exhausted and that Paladin was it. I don't know, maybe I'm looking too much into this, but that was- that, that back there was fucking hilarious. Alright. Gonna make our way out. Attack all of them! Oh boy. Oh no, not the hoarder! Oh no, I'm good, okay, okay. I'm glad the poison... You know, I just realized the, the, the hornet has a very fucking long stinger. That can literally impale me. Ooh, 
Ooh, look at all that stuff we got. Ooh, green apple. That's handy. Also, have you guys noticed the amount of health I have? I used a lot of life gems. Speaking of life, or speaking of crystals of life, uh, we'll give those to Apple Bloom so she can catch up with the others on health. Magic. Apple Bloom is like the strongest one here, so they should mostly go to her, but they can also go to Scootaloo. I should also save. Yeah, I farmed up so much, I have a... I have a butt ton of bits. Oh, come on! No. Preemptive strike. Okay, so... I figured out what preemptive strike means is you can attack them and then you can attack them again before they attack you. So that's good to know. Thundera! That's why Thundera is good. I didn't even break a sweat. Because he didn't do anything. Sweetie Bell handled all the tough stuff. But that's okay. The only enemies I don't really like are the Flans. Because I have to use magic to really dispose of them. Why would they carry those? That is a good question. And out I go! So I'm going to need a way to get off this island, because there's, there's nowhere else for me to go, there's no other caves or anything, so we'll just have to- ah! Oh, that's not so bad. We'll just have to see what we can do. The only thing that concerns me is that world stone, it, uh, it didn't look like a topaz, so maybe the topaz- no, he said the topaz was in- did he say it was the northeast, or did he say the southeast? I don't know. He said it was guarded by a monster, so this has to be the gem he was talking about, but it's not a topaz. Unless it is, and it just looks like a crystal by default. Hello, King Sir. We did it! We got the jewel! What? Sh show it to me. Uh, yeah, here it is. Uh-oh. Give it to me! Oh, no. Yeah, sure. I don't like where this is going. Give it to me! Is it me or is he acting strange? More st Oh, why is it Is it me or is he acting strange? More strange than when we first met. This jewel seems to... It's giving everyone this weird, greedy effect. What if those ponies outside in the town had the jewel taken from them, and it left them in a trance-like state until the jewel was returned, in which it wasn't? Ooh, we are in a shitboat of trouble. I don't think he acted like this before, right? It's mine! The jewel is mine! Girls, I don't think it's a good idea to give him the jewel. There is something wrong with him. Let's just stop them! Uh-oh. Since you won't give me the stone, there will be no escape for you. The jewel will leave me mine, and you ponies will be nothing but a good m What? Wait, what? Oh no! <laughs> that explains the meal part. What have you done with the king? <laughs> I cannot do an evil laugh for the life of me. I am the king! 
So you're responsible for the strange, almost lifeless ponies in town! Oh. Is that so? Yeah! You evil monster! Change them back! I don't think so. They make such good puppets. Then you must be defeated. <laughs> you three fools. Against me. I mean, I took down the paladin in like six hits. I don't think you really stand a chance against us. Fine. This should be fun. I will gladly take the jewel from your lifeless hooves. The spirit charges up a fireball, aiming it directly at the ponies. Oh, shit! <laughs> Sweetie Belle, watch out! <gasps> oh my... Oh my god! Girls, we must fight. Something tells me we have to keep this jewel away from them. Right! Sweetie Belle out of the fight? No, she's in it. Corrupted Star Spirit. You are gonna get your ass whooped. Bring it on! Let's try Thunder Up. So Blizzard, Blizzara, and Thunder are effective. Ow! Well, l luckily for me, I leveled up my health, so ha! Yeah, I'm like. Decently, I think I'm actually decently leveled for this. Did I just make Sweetie Bell use a physical attack? God damn it. Faithra. Whammo! Whammo! Thundemo! Hey, you can't do that to Apple Blue! Fuck off! You are gonna get your butt beat! I'll sh I'll teach you to mess with my friend! Alakablemo! Alakazemo! Alakathunderemo! Down! I didn't even break a sweat. Hey, we got- hey, we got apple pie, we got apple cider! Woo! Uh... The time... is coming... He... will... awaken... again... <sighs> yeah! We did it! Yes, but what did he mean when he said he will awaken again? Who will? Well, whoever it is, we can take them. Maybe we should take a little break. That was a tough fight. Thank you, brave ponies. You have freed me. Huh? Watch out, there, pony. This could be who the spirit was talking about. There is no need for force, you brave little fools. I do not plan on harming you. Who are you? Where did you come from? You better have a good explanation. I honestly don't blame Scootaloo, because after the king betrayed them like that, I'd be a little on edge too. Of course. My name is Farsight the Prophet. Fitting. I was in a magical prison by this evil spirit you defeated. After you defeated him, his magic faded. Away. Faded away. Farsight the Prophet? I've never heard of you. Why were you taken as a prisoner? I was trapped by the evil spirit because I'm a star pony. I came here to stop an ancient evil from returning. I had a vision and was told that the chosen ones would soon arrive to stop the use of that magical cutie mark. 
To stop the use of the magical cutie marks to vanquish the evil. I was looking for you because my vision showed me that you would all be here. But unfortunately, the evil already knows of your presence and sent his servant to try to take the world stone from you. Whoa! You can see into the future? Yes, I can. I am a prophet after all. What's a star pony? Star ponies are the guardians of this world. We watch over the world and we help keep track of everything. The, uh, everything that is going on in the world to make it a safe place for every pony. You can tell if some pony is a star pony by looking into our eyes. Every star pony's eyes are shaped like stars. And our tails have a star at the end. Useful to know. I have to say how grateful I am for you saving me. Now I can return to my duties to prevent the evil from coming back, but I need your help. Our help? What can we help you with? According to the prophecy, the carriers of the magical cutie marks will come to this world in a time when the ancient evil starts to return. The evil can be stopped with the power of the five world stones. But if the stones aren't collected in time, the evil will conquer the whole world and face eternal darkness. Why does this sound familiar? And we're the only ones who can stop it? We have the magical cutie marks, so we can be heroes! And we can get our real cutie marks for it! So, where are these world stones? You already have one. The, the, the jewel you recovered from the monster is one of the world stones. Apple Bloom holds up the world stone. So, this is why the monster was calling this a world stone? It doesn't really look like a mighty artifact from a prophecy. Yeah, it looks like a fashion accessory my sister would use. Don't be fooled by its appearance. It's definitely a world stone. So that's why the spirit was so greedy to get this. So, now that we have one of the world stones, what do we do now? The next one is hidden near the town of Ruby. I sense that it will not be an easy task. Oh! I get what's going on here! So we we gotta collect things like a paradox, a ruby, a topaz. I see what you're doing, I see what you're doing there, Stashy. I see it. I see it. That's clever. I sense that it will not be an easy task to get the stone, but I have faith that you will obtain it. My jaw feels so weird right here. It's not like hurting. It just feels weird, and it makes it a little hard to talk. Probably because this part's still numb, but I'm good. Of course, we are the Cutie Mark Crusaders! Cutie Mark Crusader heroes! Yay! Okay, Farsight, you can count on us. We'll get the world stones. I know, but be aware, you have a short period of time, so make haste. Right! I mean, I am kind of... Chapter 3, a new threat. I mean, I do have a, uh... I, do, I am kind of over-leveled, so... Some of the monsters shouldn't be too difficult to deal with. So, can we go anywhere? Nope. Can we go talk to him again? We don't need to go back here, okay. Welcome to Topaz Castle. That's funny. Is this? Oh. Oh, I thought everyone would be. Wait. Hi! What? What? Who are you? <laughs> Someone who lost the chosen ponies with those cute magical cutie marks for help. Our help? For what? And how do you know that we're the chosen ones? Let's just say that I've been watching you three. Also, I can detect the magical energy from that shiny little world stone of mine you have there. What? These world stones are yours? Why is it yours? Is it me, or is every pony very greedy for these stones? Because I need them. I deserve them. <laughs> no. Why do you need them? Maybe it's to change the colors of his mane. <laughs> That's not funny! I need them to fulfill my destiny! And that is... That's beyond your comprehension. Then this world stone is beyond your reach. You need to give me that stone. I need it! You still have yet to give us a reason to give you the stone. Listen, Bulls, I command you to give me that world stone. 
Now! Gosh, don't be such a Karen. This stone is more wanted than the last cup of apple cider Rainbow Dash never got. Mind you that rock my sister love. I think she called it... <laughs> hey, season two callback. I think she called it Tom. What are you talking about? Give me my world stone! <laughs> Stop laughing! <sighs> Give me my world stone! Nah, I don't think so. We aren't gonna give you the stone. <laughs> well then, I guess I have to take it myself going to another boss fight. Are you kidding me? What the f- ah! What the hell? What just happened? Ugh, that hurt. It felt like I landed on a chicken. Yeah, at least it wasn't as changeful as when we fell down into that cave. Get off of me! Scootaloo. Sorry. Are, are you alright? Oh, I get it, because they're calling Scootaloo a chicken. God, <laughs> God damn it. <sighs> I'm okay, but I'm not a chicken. So, where are we? What the what? Um, I don't know. So, what now? Do we just... Hello, you little foals, and welcome to my little world. I hope you like it, because you're going to be here for a long time. Where are we? Take us back to Topaz. Yeah, at once. <laughs> there is no escape from my prison. <laughs> Sorry, why did you bring us here? What do you want with the stone? Or the world stone? And who are you anyways? Oh, uh, where are my manners? I completely forgot to introduce myself. I am Fallen Star. Star, but of course we have to have an evil star pony. Mightiest sorcerer and ruler of all star ponies. Well, soon I will be. <laughs> what a crazy pony. Well, as long as we have the world stone, you aren't gonna rule anything. Maybe he can roll up for a hair shock so he can change his hair. <laughs> yeah. Ugh. You were all so annoying. Good luck escaping. <laughs> oh, fuck. Let's go over, phony. I'm sure there's a way out of here. Oh, fuck. Are you actually using music from Crash Twin Sanity? from Crash to Insanity! Oh my god, that's amazing! Oh, that's amazing! <clears throat> okay, I think I'm gonna end off this episode here. It's a little tiny bit shorter than last time, but... I think this is a good place to end off, so thank you everyone for watching this episode of My Little Pony RPG 2. Cutie Mark Crusader Warriors. If you like this episode, hit that like button. If you want more content in the future, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you all next time. Peace. Be sure to hit that bell if I didn't already say that. 